Good morning, welcome to the Golden Triangle 5, your five minute local update for Tavares Eustis in Mount Dora, Florida. It is August 7th, 2017. I'm Kayla Cox. And I'm J.R. Cox, and we're both realtors with Vanjie Berry Signature Realty in Eustis. And so, Kayla, let's say I wanted to take a trip back in time to a place that I've never been before. <laughs> what might I do? You might go back to the 50s, right? Maybe. There was some awesome music back then, yes. right? Well, uh, if you'd like to do that, you could do that by going tonight to, or actually this, well, this afternoon or evening, mm -hmm. to the Sharon L. Morse Performing Arts Center in the Villages. Uh -huh. uh, Frankie Avalon, oh, a, nice. a teen icon back in the... We'll say 50s. It was I'm making 50s. that up. Yeah, okay. Yeah, 50s. yeah, Frankie Avalon. He was famous for a lot of different songs. The one that I knew was Beauty School Dropout. Right. Uh, but From that movie, Grease. That movie, <laughs> yeah. Um, other songs included Venus, Bobby Socks to Stockings, uh, Gingerbread, and Just Ask Your Heart. So um, uh, that's sure to be a fun time. Yeah. Uh, the cost for the tickets, 35 to $69. So we'll pricey yeah but i mean you're traveling back in time That's so can right. you really put a price on that you have to pay for the time travel machine. <laughs> right so uh tonight for, uh, at four and at seven are the two different show times mm -hmm. um and you can contact um uh the uh performing art let's see what was it called the sharon l morse performing arts center at 352-751-7799 or email them at info at the sharon.com or uh, you could also just go to the ticket website, which is tickets.vendini.com, V-E-N-D-I-N-I.com. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. So that's in the villages on Main Street. Very cool. Yeah. And they, they've also got a lot of other um, people coming, like different concerts and right, stuff. We yeah, looked at a little, list. Yeah. Like Clint Black, Kansas, Leanne Rimes. Yeah. Uh, I can't remember who else I mentioned. Yeah. So a lot of, a lot of different people. I think Sticks was that? That was a past one event, oh, but yeah. uh, maybe they'll come back. Yeah. So anyway, that would, so that's a pretty cool venue, fairly close. Yeah. Yeah. So the weather for today is mostly cloudy with rain, most likely at around 7 p.m. for Tavares. And the real feels around 111. So uh, it looks like maybe the rain will hold off until the evening, perhaps. But that's when I had planned on going fishing. So, well. Perfect time for fishing. <laughs> right. All right. Well, let's do the real estate market update. Uh, in the past, well, actually over the weekend, we saw 10 homes go listed for sale. 10 more went under contract and five more sold. So again, more leaving than coming on the right. market. So the real estate question of the day is what should I disclose as a seller? Uh, really, everything. But uh, legally, you are required to disclose anything that materially affects the value of the home. Mm. Uh, but let's say you had something in the past, like a roof leak, and everything's been repaired and fixed and everything like that. There's nothing to disclose then because it's no longer affecting the value of the house, and there are no lingering issues. Right. But it's always safe to just disclose. And there's a seller's disclosure form yes. that is customary to fill out. Asks you all kinds of questions, and the uh, the realtor is not allowed to help you fill that out. So you just kind of have to go on your own mm -hmm. to determine what it's asking and what you want to answer. Right. Yeah. And usually that's talking about the current issues of the house. Not it says things right. like currently leaking or right. right like, it does yeah. ask if anything has ever has like flood water ever affected right. the house or something right. like that then you do have to answer that. Right, yeah. So, good. yeah, good. To, there are there are some things that are kind of surprising that you do not have to disclose, though, right? Like, um, if there was a murder there. Right. Pa past um, uh, uh, case law has said, no, that's not, that doesn't materially affect the value of the house. So there are some interesting things that, mm -hmm. you know, you don't have to disclose that kind of seems like maybe you should have to, but right. anyway. All right. Well, thank you for joining us on the Golden Triangle 5, your five-minute local update for Tavares, Eustis, and Mount Dora, Florida. If you have more questions about the local real estate market, leave us a comment below. Talk to you tomorrow.